What is your view of God like? I was playing the piano this evening and I realized there could be an analogy here. So, here's what we think of as God. Okay, it's nothing really thrilling or deep, anything. It's just playing a few chords, right? But I really think God is deeper than we give him credit for, than we think he is. If we were made in the image of God, and we have days when we're down and sad, and days when we're elated and joyful, then God has those days too. Um, God is not man, but he is deep and he is, uh, he is worthy of our love um, as we are blessed to have his love. So, God is more like this. give ourselves credit for being deep and for having emotion and then we just think that we have an emotionless God and it's really not true. Um, so I encourage you to seek out who God is, to understand the attributes of God. I think you will be impressed. I think for those of you who have um, enjoyed intimate relations with uh, a guy or a girl, you will know the depths of um, love that you can have, uh, especially in the marriage relationship. Um, in my opinion, my relationship with my wife just gets deeper and richer and better. Um, so I encourage you to seek him out, to try to find the Lord, to Read the Bible, um, read about Galatians, and read about liberty. You will find that he is just much more beautiful than you can imagine. is that you should not be returning to the weak and beggarly elements. If you have accepted Christ, uh, you've acknowledged him in your heart and uh, believed him, Romans 10, 9 talks about that, then you are his and he has given you liberty, um, which is an amazing thing, uh, which I'm only just scratching the surface of. Um, but you should not return to the weak and beggarly elements, um, which are law, um, do's and don'ts, these things. Uh, you have been freed, and you are free indeed. So, in that freedom, you can get to know the Lord better, and I hope you do.